हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल आई एम डॉक्टर स्वाति अग्रवाल कंसल्टेंट डर्माटोलॉजिस्ट फ्रॉम न्यू रूट हेयर क्लिनिक नागपुर सो टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक हेयर क्लोनिंग व्हाट इज हेयर क्लोनिंग सो हेयर क्लोनिंग क्लोनिंग इज अ प्रोसेस दैट क्रिएट्स न्यू हेयर्स फ्रॉम द डोनर हेयर फॉलिकल्स इन अ सॉर्ट ऑफ मल्टीप्लीकेशन प्रोसेस सो बेसिकली इट इन्वॉल्व एक्सट्रैक्टिंग न्यू सेल्स फ्रॉम हेयर फॉलिकल रेप्लीकेटिंग दैम इन अ लैब and re-implanting them on your hairs uh, to grow new hair how effective it is efficacy of this method varies because regenerative capacity depend on existing follicles so what happens basically in this process dermal papilla cells and keratinocytes they are the main key regulators for hair growth dermal papilla cells stimulate the proliferation and differentiation of keratinocytes essential for the formation of hair graft is hair cloning a reality yes hair cloning is very much real and very much happening many clinical trials and research are underway many companies are trying experiment one of the best company to begin experiment was intercytics they tested their method in phase 2 trial they showed very promising results as Two third of the male bal patients were able to grow new hair after treatment, but in 2010 they decided to discontinue all their research. Another firm researching was ARI, Adidas Research Institute. It's a Japanese company work for Jigami process, which involves removal of strip from the scalp and divided into the follicular stem cells. They then multiplied, cultured. and injected into a bald area of skin during phase 2 trials they found that a process is not suitable for multiplications rather revitalize the follicles prevent future loss they stopped research in 2013 but in a uh, technical university they were only able to clone one or two follicles which are not sufficient according to university of pennsylvania stem cells are present in both bald and non bald area but progenitor cells are depleted in october 2022 uh, now yokohama national university successfully cloned full grown mouse hair follicles in the history there will always be concern for safety and overall health impacts at last hair cloning could be the next step uh, in curing baldness as a ray of, uh, ray of hope worldwide thank you